Yo, what's going on guys, and yesterday, I think, I saw this guy, right, and he's Irish, and he makes stuff, here's his channel, I'm going to link it below, and he basically gets old accents, and turns them into new accents, I'm like, that's a great idea for a video, so I've got this, it's absolutely disgusting, it's really, really rusty, with wood inside of it, with like, whatever this orange stuff is, broken tip on the blade, and really bad, condition I'm gonna try and make it new I also got this piece of wood that I can make as the handle yeah so I'm gonna try and get this bit outside and then I'm gonna get off with the rust see if me getting out this okay so outside it's like really dark because it's night time but I need to get this video out so I'm having to go into the garage I want to hammer out that using this very cheap chisel I bought and I want to hammer out that inside and I've got to go through such extremes so here's my current filming set like what the hell so I've got like that attached to a garage door and with the planes lifted up with the cool carpet lifted up with the chisel and the super complicated I'll cut to me trying to get that out and that isn't moving anywhere That was actually really good hit as well. I'm actually getting somewhere now. I mean, like, I could just finish the video here. <laughs> That's really far right now, oh my god. Okay. Okay, so I'm back with the correct tool for the job. Okay, so I know I know you can't see, but that goes straight through now. And so is that, so we're really close. Um, new blade, let's continue. <laughs> Okay, so I've just finished doing this. You can see that's carved in, which makes a really nice handle grip. And now I'm gonna try and sand around the edges like that. So, and that's what it looks like. I've also given it a quick once over with the knife to round it out. It's feeling quite like a handle.
see. If I hadn't landed my toes, that would have been quite bad. But yeah, I'll give this once over with the... Finer sander to get off all the big roots and stuff, and then I'll give it some sandpaper and then try and carve the top to put the accent on. See you then. I've done most of the sanding and stuff, and that's looking quite nice and it's feeling really nice. Okay, so here's the axe head. It's going on there. And overall, it's looking quite nice. Nice and practical axe. I'm going to do more sanding off camera. Um, but I'm just gonna polish up the head with some nice sanding quickly. So. Okay, so here's how it looks. Now let's just quickly run and do some water to get the rest of it. Oh wow. Look how it shines on that. It's really good. Compared to this side, that's a lot better. So now I'm going to do this for the other sides. I put some WD-40 on it and that's looking a lot better. Yeah, let's do the other sides. Okay, this axe head's as good as I'm going to get it for the time I've spent on it. And I've got to get this video out in three hours. So, and I haven't even started editing or even finished the handle. So, I think this is what I can do for this. Tell me if you want a part two, right? really polish this up and make this ultra shiny and really finish the axe handle but yeah I need to move on to that now so let's sand that more. Okay so I spent all night last night doing this and it's currently quite nice and thin which sort of matches the shape of that axe so it goes in quite nicely for the first bit. Also I have some veneer on the back there to get some contrast hand bits fit my fingers nicely also this gritty sander really hurts you getting your finger so just warning everyone yeah okay let's try and put this thing on there so that's already pretty sturdy but I should take I think now I'm just going to glue that on and I'll put some oil on it and I'll do the chop test. See you there. Okay, so I don't actually know how to do this, let's just go ham. Just... Okay, I'm back. Just glued on the handle. Try and cut this. Okay, I've just glued on the handle with some nice trusty Gorilla glue. Now let's test it again. Okay, so we're back this time at night because the glue took ages to set. I've got to get this out, this video out in like five minutes. So let's get this done. Okay, so let's just see whether it actually drops. Yeah, yeah, 
I think that works. Remember to like and subscribe. Top three comments of the video are here. This has been really fun. Here's the axe. Fun time. This is really nice. I think if you guys want, I can go back over it and make it look a little bit nicer. But I don't currently have the time because I've got this video out in a little bit. Yeah, remember to like and subscribe. See you next time. Thanks.